session I'm going to show you what Zo did on their list view. They made a change on how things look and a little bit about the functionality. And in this video, I'm going to show you what was done and how to work with this new view. I got some emails from students that saying that they can find, you know, their way with the new design. And this is exactly the reason that I have this video. Now, some of you might see this new release, some of you not. Now, the ones that do see it, they can take advantage of this video immediately. The ones that do not see this change yet will be able to do to take advantage of this video once the, they will get the new release. So when you go to the list view, you will see a few new changes. So first of all, the columns can be uh, changed. So you can uh, uh, make the change by yourself. You can also click on sorting uh, on the contact name and you can sort based on the name with a small filter. So here, for example, it's only contacts with the name of C. And I have here some, one of them is T, for example. So I will go to T and you can see that it's just filtering the T. So that's, that's really a quick filter. Now, of course, if you click on the name, it's showing you also the ascending and descending sorting, which also uh, uh, was in the old view. Now, one more cool thing, let's say that um, I'm wrapping up this, uh, this column, you can see that the text on the bottom is changing, right? Now, you can also go uh, to this small uh, button on the right side and when you click on clip test text then basically it's clipping it to the size of the column so you can see that it's gone so it's not wrapping it anymore so this is also cool sometimes you have for example we have the follow-up comments which is a box with lots of text I don't want it to be clipped I want it to be wrapped because I want the agent to see all the comments so that's, that's a great thing that, uh, that they did. Now on the right side, you can see in this button, you can click on manage columns and then you can add and remove more columns to this list. You can also drag and drop and uh, sort them in the way that is working for you. Uh, also in the old view, the, uh, the manage columns were, was a bit buggy. And in this one, I did not see a bug yet. So, so it's, it's working in a better way than the old one. Uh, you can also click on reset column size. And when, once you do that, it will just try like Excel to put everything in the right size. So everything will be visible nicely, which is also a cool thing. In the action columns, it's exactly the same action columns that you had before. Nothing changed here. Um, if you click uh, on this button, you're getting all the different uh, views, the list, Kanban and Canvas. Nothing was done here as far as I know. Once you will click on uh, some records, you will see that you have the actions. Nothing really changed here. You have the same feature and same options as before. So that's uh, nothing new. Uh, one more thing that you have here on the left side, you have this small uh, filter button. If you click on that, it will hide and show the filtration on the left side. If you will click on uh, a record, uh, and that's something that is also existing in the old version, but sometimes people are calling us and saying, I just lost all my related lists. So if you click on this small button, you will see that this is gone. And if you click on it, it's showing again. In the old view, this button is in the center. And this is why people, I think, lost it. So here you can see that you show and hide the records on the left side, which is great for small screens. And this is great. One more thing that is uh, going to be released soon, there will be some updates to the workflow rules. We're still waiting for those updates, but uh, be ready for some changes especially in this area of the when, there will be some changes. And once those changes will be released, of course, that I will create you a video for it. That's it. That's the update for this morning. If you like this session, thumbs up is always appreciated. I wish you a beautiful day. Mm -hmm.